So here's the Volt Bike Yukon 750. We got it all taken apart now. Rear wheel off, cranks off, battery out. Uh, all the parts are right here, most of them. We got the new wheel over here. Fits in the dropouts perfectly, everything's good. And uh, we're gonna get a controller uh, mounted back here, but it won't be OEM looking like the original one. And uh, we're gonna get everything back on, all the new stuff on. Uh, the battery output will probably probably be a XT60 connector, I think. And we'll have to solder that to the wires. And uh, yeah, it should be a should be a pretty easy conversion. It'll make this bike like new. All right, so the controller's mounted here. Good amount of clearance from the fender. Fender's mounted back on. All the cables come out the bottom here. Have the thumb throttle mounted, cable coming out. So yeah, we'll update you as we get farther. Okay, so here we got the Volt Bike Yukon 750. Rear wheels on, 1500 watt motor. Controllers on, chains on, needed two chains. Well, a chain and a few links because a single 116 link chain is too short. Uh, controller up here, grips. We had to put a new caliper on the rear because this is a winter bike and the, uh, the caliper pistons were a bit seized. They weren't too bad, but they're bad enough to keep rubbing. So we, we just swapped it out for a different caliper. New disc. Uh, now we, to finish it, we have to put on this Grin torque arm, the V6. And uh, those are the axle spacers. And then here's the connection for the battery. It goes in up here. And here's the battery. Nice brand new one. 48 volt, 25 amp hour. Nice and big, should do the trick. So there's the torque arm installed. And uh, we took it out for a test ride. It's good to go. Goes really fast. Uh, we had to run the power cable on the outside of the frame. We didn't have to, but it was really, it was really annoying to stuff down here and get out the bottom because there's only a little hole down here. So that's how it's ran right now. We may in the future switch it up, but we're leaving it like this for now. Big battery on it. Yeah, it's good to go. Quite the upgrade for this uh, Yukon 750.